Hey, happy 2019 Chuck Harstenson Remax results and doing a quick video. Melissa and I are on vacation for our anniversary in Florida, but I wanna pop online and share a couple things really quick with what we got going on. Um, so I'm gonna talk a little bit about the market in 2019 or what it is currently and a little bit about what we've got coming up that's new that uh, we're happen, you know, that we're doing in 2019. And again, Happy New Year. If you jump on this or watch the recording, please say hi or like it or share it or whatever you wa would want to do. That'd be great. And hope everybody had a great New Year. Uh, I, I went to bed a little bit early. I wanted to get some sleep <laughs> to start my year out good. So uh, 2019 real estate market insights. Like right now and what's gonna happen on earlier in the year, I think there's always a little bit of confusion because people, Maybe listen to the news, which, which I don't really listen to news. I, I read a lot about what's happening in real estate. Even how real estate writers write it, they're like, oh, there's a slowdown in the market. Well, a slowdown, what this is, is say back in May, uh, some of the markets in the, around the Twin Cities, Minnesota, you know, the market was way up. And say there was 12% appreciation, maybe on average, through that time of the year in a lot of the areas we work. And year over year, Minnesota ended up with six percent or so appreciation that means at the peak of the market in 2018 the market was say up 12 percent and it ended up up six so meaning at some point it actually went down about six percent so what's that mean for you simple math maybe you're in an area where that happened and you had a two hundred thousand dollar house in may um and you saw your neighbor sell for two hundred thousand and i'm just doing two hundred thousand because that's simple math well, your house then right now is actually worth 188. And you're like, oh my gosh, that's horrible. It went down that much. Well, if it went up 12% and down 6% and it ended up at 6% appreciation, well, what was it a year ago? Well, that means it was like 178. So it actually did go up 10, $12,000. So you're better off than you were a year ago. And the market is set to have some normal appreciation that's like three to 6% in 2019. So there's still fairly low inventory, although a little bit more, so that helps buyers in a lot of the price ranges, although the, the first time home buyer price ranges are still a little bit down. And interest rates are still below 5%, but they are gonna go up. So if you are thinking about buying, I would do it earlier in the year. And that means sellers, there's still less inventory. If you are thinking about selling, I would get going earlier in the year, beat that tipping point that could be the spring market, let's say May, of where maybe it has a slight decline again, where it jumps up and goes down a little bit. So you gotta understand there's that little bit of a curve in the market, like it was in 2018, that's gonna happen again in 2019, in my opinion. So that's the brief insight on that. I probably shared that before, depending on where you've heard it, or if you've met with me directly, we might've talked about that. So what's happening with the Carstensen team in 2019? And this one's on Facebook, so we'll stu still do some Facebook contests in 2019. A lot more videos, you're gonna see a ton more video content market content more insight uh we got make a difference mondays coming up starting monday where we you know visit a charity talk to somebody who is involved with the charity uh do some kind of charitable item and trying to make a difference helping people making the world and leaving the world a better place and we want to share that what other people are doing what we're doing what you could do and we you know one of our main things one of our main purposes is to make an impact and make a difference on those lives around us. So we, you're gonna see that this year, um, a regular routine video series. And then also I am, I gotta, I gotta put this out there because the, the, the more I put it out there, the quicker I'll get going on it, is I'm gonna start a podcast that does relate to real estate insights, personal growth, and making a difference and helping people. And I'm gonna be talking to people who are making a difference, people in real estate, some people not in real estate, and um, I wanted to probably have it actually started by this time already, but with all this video stuff and other things we're doing, it's just, it's coming along. I'm getting closer. I got the equipment, did a practice run on one, and, and pretty soon we'll get that going. So look for that podcast coming up soon. Uh, lots of stuff going on with the Carstensen team. So if you're looking to buy or sell a property, check out, um, you know, talk to who you know, whether it's myself or Michelle, Barbara, or Stacy, the realtors on our team, uh, reach out to them if you know them, or if you don't know us, you know, 
We're always still happy to help you. You're on our page, you have a real estate question, you know you're making a move this year, or just not sure what's going on in the market, you're always welcome to reach out to us. So probably after this video, Esther will go through it um, today or tomorrow and put some notes online and uh, you know give you a couple spots to advance to and watch re-watch this quick video. Um, video marketing wise, my wife does a lot of that. So gets us a chance to spend a little more time together and she's doing the editing. So again, look for all those videos and reach out to us if you have some real estate needs. Happy New Year and we'll talk to you soon.